Before we deeply analyze marketing strategies, let's quickly go through a brief introduction about the brand. Bode is a lifestyle brand in fashionable consumer electronics like earphones, headphones, speakers, and premium cables. In 2016, two co-founders Aman Gupta and Sameer Mehta launched a brand called Bode. Its first product was an unbreakable Apple cable that cost rupees 1,500. The product was an instant hit. There are many reasons why Bode is so successful. For example, their consumer-first approach and improvisations, and continually innovating and expanding catalog. However, above all this, there is one strategy that has upped their game, and that is online marketing. The problem that the brand identified were first, Indian consumers wanted long-lasting and tangle-free earphones that were affordable and good quality, but were also fashionable. Second, consumers were bored of plastic microphones that offered less comfort and quality. Before Bose's entry, there were many established audio brands in the market like JBL, Sony, Sennheiser, and Skullcandy. Mostly the brands were either global or Chinese. In 2014, the earphones were just electronic accessories along with phones. However, it changed when Bose introduced funky and stylish audio accessories that resonated well with customers' personality or their interests, along with quality and tangle-free long cables. They also made metal earphones, which was a need they already identified. The objective of creating a brand like Bose was to offer affordable, durable, and fashionable audio devices and accessories. Let's understand step by step how digital marketing strategies helped Bose to become a top audio brand in India. With mobile marketing, Bose used omnichannel to send personalized messages on mobile, like using apps and SMS marketing to reach the right customers in real time based on someone's online behavior and interests. This way, they were able to create a demand from potential and existing customers' need. With email marketing, the brand focused on personalized messages to existing and potential customers by sending unorthodox, catchy, and short emails. The research has proven that short emails have higher open rate compared to long boring emails. Bode has been phenomenal in implementing its social media strategies, which help them outsmart their competitors. I would say their major revenue share comes from social media marketing through organic and paid mediums. The brand has stayed away from conventional media like TV and print. Bode has been innovative when creating hashtags for social media campaigns. For example, on Instagram they started hashtag do what floats your boat, which is inspired by the idiom whatever floats your boat, meaning finding something exciting, attractive or interesting. This mostly appealed to generation Z that helped to create a niche segment for the brand to integrate the product with the culture and lives of skaters, street artists, etc. Hashtag be a boathead is associated with stone speakers for bold, confident and cool features. It displays celebrities like Kiara Dwani, Hardik Pandya, Kartik Aryan etc with boat products. Similarly, they have many such innovative hashtag trends that have most of the time struck the right marketing chord and made their followers go gaga over the new launches. Boat gets on some different level when it comes to storytelling. Consistently, they have been running such campaigns that showed brand as a part of some bold or interesting stories. For example, the brand started illustration through a comic that connected well with comic lovers with hashtag boat adventures, hashtag Delhi saga. The idea was to target niche audiences while allowing them to connect to the comic. The second campaign, I'm a rebel, tells a story of a bold character featuring famous and bold women personalities like. Vijay Bani, MMA fighter Sanika Patel, rapper Raja Kumari, with upbeat music on YouTube. The social campaign highlights Bose's new earbuds and earphones called Treble, exclusively for today's women. The brand has a sea event marketing strategy through tie-ups with almost every important event in India that has helped them to build a large community of Bose heads. Let's discuss a few of them. As soon as the IPL fear went high, Bose announced their official partnership with six IPL teams. and launch limited edition of earbuds designed after each team bringing home real ipl connection to the cricket fans with the social campaign sound of champion another important event that boat is part of is like me fashion week the models use boat as a fashion accessory while doing a ramp walk that's really a nice place to get some attention and boat has definitely killed it in order to target music enthusiasts boat often collaborates with the music personalities and events Recently a campaign leave the sound created a buzz on social media when Bode tied up with Punjabi NRI singer AP Dilon for his first live tour in India. In short, Bode never misses out on such popular events as it helps the brand to promote to a much larger audience. 
I love Marvel superheroes and many of us truly do. That was the basis on which the social media campaign Unleash Your Super was launched. Boot launched a series of new catalog of earbuds, headphones and speakers for characters like Iron Man, Captain America and Black Panther. This was a great marketing innovation to attract all Marvel fans. The brand has been building and engaging Boot community on social media platforms like Instagram and Facebook for a long time. The community building activity like sharing customers pictures with product on the stories is a great way to build a community around a brand. You would also often see celebs conversing with the community as part of their promotional strategy. Now the next job was to keep this community engaged. So they started with giveaway contests. Due to this, many botheads keep participating and sharing posts on social media. Hashtag I'm a #botthead has attracted nearly 600 posts on Instagram. Botted community has rapidly grown to more than 10 lakh members and it is still growing. It is quite commendable to see how in just few years a brand has grown multifold due to its right online marketing strategies. Next we are going to discuss a YouTube campaign strategized by a marketing agency called Social Bait for Bot. Botheads are trend setter who never stops moving and live in the now moment. Bot's persona has connected deeply with the audiences who are expressive and innovative. As we discussed before, the startup leveraged India's love for music, cricket, and Bollywood through influencers and celebrities. One of the campaign was IPL #SoundOfChampion that signed famous figures in cricket like Shikhar Dhawan, Prithvi Shaw, Rishabh Pant, KL Rahul, Jasprit Bumrah, and Hardik Pandya. This social media campaign was a hit, and the agency Social Bait was given a job to use this to further increase brand awareness and ad recall. Agency used two types of campaign. First. True view for reach this type of campaign allows you to reach maximum people over the allocated time true view ad allows advertisers to pay only if the viewer watches complete ad second google display campaign was set up with the objective of maximum clicks and a retargeting campaign for those who interacted with the brand's youtube ads 30 seconds video sequencing with product cta was created video sequencing is a format where you can tell your product story by showing people series of video ads in order defined by you. For example, agency created a series of IPL related short videos featuring cricketers in some funny scenarios with both products. The sequencing helps advertisers to increase awareness, build interest or reinforce a message. How it works depends on the criteria you have defined. Take for an instance, you saw first video of both in a sequence and to move to the next video an impression or the click must be counted for the video in the first step. For this, you have to define impression or click as criteria to move to the next step. Five cities were targeted: Delhi, Mumbai, Bangalore, Chennai, and Hyderabad based on the past sales. Age group were relatively very young, 18 to 24 and 25 to 34. The placements were premium, music channels like T-series and Wave Music etc. The audiences defined were affinity for cricket enthusiasts and music lovers and in market for speakers and headphone buyers. For those who are not aware, Affinity audiences are people who have an interest or are passionate about a particular product or product category. In this case, we will consider audience that likes consumer electronic products. And in-market audiences are the likely buyers who are actively considering buying a product like Boat. Once the brand awareness was created, retargeted ads were run on Google Display with a custom affinity audiences who are interested in Boat products. So someone who have shown interest in the previous targeting will be retargeted with boat products. The agency achieved phenomenal results. The campaign received 44.4 million impressions with 3.9 lakh clicks. There was lift in product interest by 15.5%. The click cost also decreased by 59% and the brand interest increased by 158.7%. Boat has proved that even a young company can grow faster and outplay big giants if the online marketing strategies are placed correctly. Yes, of course, the product quality is equally important and the brand has done extremely well in both the fields. This lifestyle brand has taken advantage of the online social platform smartly to connect with the right audience at the right time, allowing target audiences to recall brand. Keeping audiences engaged with BT and funny social media campaigns consistently has allowed them to build a large boat head community. and has created a unique position for the brand in the minds of their audiences